In this video, you'll learn how to make Facebook Reels that get views. We'll cover everything from creating Facebook Reels through the Facebook Reels video upload process and the key Facebook Reels settings you need to know. All right, today I'm gonna to show you how to create a Facebook Reel. First, you access the Facebook app. So click right there. And if you are on your personal profile, this is how you'll do it. You'll go to the plus sign up the top here, and then you go to Reel, that easy. Let me just quickly show you how you access it if you were on a page. So if you've got a Facebook page, maybe it's a business or something like that, it's a little bit different. You can see down the bottom here, there's a plus button. You can access it that way. Or you can also access it up the top here. You can see stories, you can create a story, or you can go to Reels and create a Reel. And you can do it that way. So as you can see in the top here, we've got camera, which will send you to the camera and you will be on screen like so. You can get into the music where it's got a, a large list of songs and you can, you know, cut your clip that way by starting with the music and then start editing. Alternatively, you can start filming and then add the music later. It just depends on which way you want to go there. You can add effects and there are so many different weird and wonderful things you can do there. Or you can go onto a green screen and start editing there. And as you can see, it's really effective. Just to press the button and you know, you've got an instant background like the Brooklyn Bridge, or you can even go to your camera roll here and select something from your camera roll, whether it be the beautiful sunrise I took this morning, or it can be a video as well. So let me just show you an example of that. Yeah, that's crazy. Hey, how good's that? So lots of different examples there. All right, so let's have a look at what happens when you hit record. Record button is down here, down the bottom. You can either tap it once and it will start recording or you can press and hold. And when you let go, it will finish. So I'm just going to hit record. And at the top here, you'll see your record progress bar, which will go to the full 90 seconds duration if that's how long you want your clip to be. Or you can hit stop. Let's say we want to add one more clip. We hit edit, we hit add, we go to camera and we're back on camera. Hit record again. And there we go, it starts recording another clip. As you can see, the progress record bar is starting to load again and we are recording another clip. We'll hit stop and it's added it to our timeline. Let's add one more. And here we are talking about how to make a Facebook Reel. It really is that easy and it's added it to our timeline down below. As you can see, we can add text. We can change colors and add backgrounds and we can even have a robot voice say it for us. Let's have a listen. Hi, my name is Tom. Hi, my name is Tom. Very interesting. I'm going to turn that off and I'll just put that away. We can add noise reducer if we want to get rid of any background sound, but I've gotten rid of my audio for now, so that is unable. You can add your effects, as you know. Captions can transcribe the audio and that will almost instantly generate captions for you, which is very, very cool, as most people have their phones on mute so they can see what you're talking about straight away. You can edit the captions. Facebook doesn't always get it right. As you can see here, Facebook group, they've even spelt real wrong. It's double E L Facebook, come on. So you can edit it there if you wish. You can have it typing on, you can have it flipping on like so. There's a few different options there, which is really cool. You can add stickers if you wish. Let's give me some sunglasses. Looking good, Tom. You can even add GIFs. Let's add this chick, she looks pretty cool. So you can see how easy it is to create something entirely from the app here and using your phone's camera. But for those of you that wanna create something using footage you've already shot on a more professional camera, or even from stock footage that you might have, you can transfer those clips to your phone and create something really amazing in here too. I'll give you a quick example. I recently shot a wedding for some good friends, Rodrigo and Sofia, and I used a professional camera, obviously. And so I'm gonna import those shots into the app and then create an edit in there. So simply grab your clips, import them in, adjust the start and end times on them like so, grab the next clip and again, make the adjustments and so on. We can also add in some stills and even adjust the speed controls of the clips in here too. So pretty quickly, we're able to create something that looks really professional using our existing professional footage and then importing it into the app. And when you're done, you just want to hit done. When you're happy with your reel, you can hit next. So in here, we can write our caption, we can hashtag, we can mention, we can choose who gets to see it, whether it's just your friends or the public. Once you're all done, you just need to hit share now and your new Facebook reel will be posted. To help you take your reels to the next level, we've got our complete CapCut tutorial linked on screen. 
It's an amazing video editing tool for all your devices with so many cool built-in templates and effects you can use. There's also a link to my personal channel. I'd love to see you over there as well. As always, we've got a ton of resources linked in the description box below to help you even further. See you in the next one.